Hello, all you big, beautiful brains out there. Today, we're going to talk about the Mueller Liar Illusion. Before we get started, take a minute to subscribe to Psy vs. Psy. Help out your friendly neighborhood psychologist while I tell you all about the Mueller Liar Illusion. So, if I showed you this drawing, and asked you to tell me which line was longer, which would you choose? Believe it or not, your answer might be based more on where you grew up than the lines themselves. First found all the way back in 1889 by Franz Carl Mueller Lyer, the Mueller Lyer illusion is a great example of how our perception can impact our senses. People growing up in different cultures with different experiences naturally perceive the world in different ways. The things you see and interact with all the time are familiar to you, and you base some of your interpretations about the world around you on those familiar experiences. In the Mueller Liar Illusion, what you see is heavily impacted by if you grew up culturally around right angles. A lot of us see right angles in the world around us every day. The shape of the room you're in, the door you walked through to get there, even the phone you're holding, or the computer you're watching this video on. But in the natural world, right angles are kind of rare. You don't find right angles naturally occurring in the woods or out in an open field. The Mueller Liar Illusion plays off this experience a lot of us have with right angles to make it seem as if one of the lines is much longer, when in reality, they're the exact same length. The illusion creates a forced depth, only seen by people with experience living in a world with right angles. Now, the illusion has been demonstrated several times throughout the 20th century. What keeps holding true scientifically is that the participants from right angle cultures, so people from major urban areas all around the world, when you show them this same picture, they interpret one line as being longer. While those without forced right angle experience, so people from less industrialized areas, can easily see that these two lines are the exact same length where they lived and their previous experiences changed how their brain interpreted what they saw. If you want to know more about how your brain interprets what you see, make sure you subscribe to Psy vs. Psy so you can get all of our other videos and you can learn all about the science of psychology. Until next time, keep thinking and I'll see y'all later. Bye!